Walters. I'm Pam Hiller, AccuQuilts Cutting Expert. And I am Erica, AccuQuilts Corporate Marketing Specialist. Okay, welcome to today's launch party called Sure and it is. Sure. It's groovy. Tuesday, Tuesday. It is to do, to do, to do, to do, to do, to do, Tuesday. So in spirit of all the twos, we are thrilled to launch today two new dyes. That's right. We are always looking for new ways to bring you innovative products to help you create fun quilt blocks. Using Aki Quilt Dyes will make creating such time-consuming shapes so fast and easy so you can get back to sewing. And we are super excited about these two new dyes. That's dives. right, we are. They are so fun, they're easy to use, and they are bound to bring you some good luck. There you go. All right, let's get Tuesday's launch party started. As always, we've planned tons of fun with great prizes, exciting project ideas, a peaceful trunk show, and lucky deals. That's right. Well, let's not wait any longer. Here's a look at our two brand new dyes. Quilters, are you ready to add more colors and symbols to your projects? Then you're going to love our two new applique dies. Introducing the Go Peace Sign and Go Shamrock. Your next project is sure to be a hit when you use the Go Peace Sign. Create a fun quilt for the teen in your life or embellish your next weekend project for a fun look. The Go Shamrock die is perfect for St. Patrick's Day and springtime projects. If you want to add a bit more luck, you'll be happy to know that it also coordinates well with the horseshoe from the Go Western Medley die. Both of these dies will work in all of our AccuQuilt fabric cutters, and your luck doesn't end there. You'll also receive access to free patterns and embroidery designs. It's time for you to find your inner peace as you create some fun projects with these adorable new applique dies. And remember, at AccuQuilt, we help you cut time so you can quilt more. Oh, quilters, working with these two dies has been so peaceful. It truly has. Now, the Go Shamrock and Go Peace Sign dies are compatible with all of our Go fabric cutters, including the Go Me. And they include free patterns and downloadable embroidery designs. They are also super scrap friendly and can be used in so many fun ways. Now, quilters, we're sure you're wondering how to get your hands on these dies and you're in luck. See? We have bundles and deals available for you today. So to get your order in during the show, you can use your phone's camera to capture the QR image. You're gonna go right to the site and our bundles. And the first bundle we have available is the Go Tuesday die bundle, which comes with our brand new Go Peace Sign and Go Shamrock dies, a six by six cutting mat, the embroidery for both the Peace Sign and the Shamrock designs. And this bundle has a value of $109. You can get it today for $74.99, saving you over $33. That's right. The second bundle we have for you is the Go Groovy Die Bundle. You're gonna get the Go Peace Sign, the Go Cute Car, the Go Square six inch finished, and three mats, six by six, five by 10, and 10 by 10. This bundle is valued at $167, but you can add it to your collection today for just $119.99. It's gonna save you over $46 today. Okay, now you're gonna get the Go Love and Luck Die Bundle. You'll get the Go Shamrock, with our Go Hearts, it has that two, three, and four inch hearts, the Go Western Medley die, and three cutting mats, six by six, five by 10, and six by 12. This bundle is valued at $187, but you can get it today for $119.99, saving you over $66. And last but certainly not least, we have the Go Peace, Love, and Luck die bundle. Yes. Here you'll get the Go Peace sign with the Go Shamrock, the Go Hearts, two, three, and four inch, the Go Western Medley, and the Go Cute Car, and of course, the Go six inch finish square to embroider them onto. Four cutting mats, six by six, five by 10, six by 12, and 10 by 10, everything you need. Now this bundle is valued at $332, but you can get it today for just $219.99. It's gonna save you over $111. 
And wait, there's more. You can use the promo code SPRING35, though you would not know that outside in Nebraska. You today. would not, there's... but we have bright, springy colored shirts on. We do. <laughs> to get 35% off your dyes and bundles at checkout, quilters, some exclusions apply. Be sure and check the website for details. Now, keep in mind the bundles we just mentioned are already marked down and won't be eligible for that promo code. But there are tons of items you can stock up with on spring 35. Now, quilters, you're going to get free shipping when your order reaches $150 or more if you live in the contiguous U.S. No code is needed at checkout to redeem that offer. Now, quilters, if you don't have access to a QR reader, no worries. Just open up a new tab in your browser, go to the top of the page and click on that plus sign. In that very top box, type in accuquilt.com slash party to see the bundles and place your order. That way you won't miss a minute of our groovy show. Groovy. I know. So you can also find our products at your local AccuQuilt retailer. To find the retailer closest to you, check out the store locator at the top of the page at accuquilt.com or look at the end of the rainbow. Oh, look at her. I love that. Okay, cool now. <laughs> Pay later. For more information on financing through AccuQuilt, visit AccuQuilt.com slash financing. All right, quilters, let's take a look at these two new dies. Let's start with our Go Shamrock die. That's right. If you can stare the glare from Pam's shirt. No, it's pretty We're not going to lose her. I'm, no. I'm a little bit. I thought I, was, I thought I was pretty bold, and then I saw Pam, and yeah. I thought, nope, she's got me beat. I know. All it, right. I was gonna say, just close in the dark. Okay, so here's our shamrock die. That's so right. Die. Now, quilters, it is a shamrock, not a four leaf clover. Very important. Very important to know that. This shamrock has been a customer request for years and we are so happy to be welcoming it into the dye family. And coincidentally, just in time for St. Patrick's Day. Look at us. Okay, it would take forever to cut these by hand and they would never look as good as the die cut version. Never, ever. Now, if you aren't familiar with our applique shapes, they are super easy to use. You want to iron um, fusible to the back of your fabric, mm -hmm. um, so which we've done here. Um, we have some on our website. We have heat and bond or soft fuse, mm -hmm. okay? And uh, iron it to the back, and then you can cut it on your die. It's super simple. That's right. And while you can always cut up to six layers of cotton fabric on our dies, you'll need to count that fusible as half a layer. Right. So that means you can cut up to four shamrocks at a time, or four peace signs. That's right. And the peace sign is another often requested shape. Now, so I would tell you, this would be even harder to cut with the Oh, because definitely. You have to cut up those little inside shapes, mm -hmm. right? And, but with our die, it's just a snap. So let's cut some of both, That's shall right. we? Okay, so we learned a great thing today. Um, these are perfect for charm squares. Yes, which are five inches. Right. So if, think quilters, if in your little quilting stash, you had some charm squares, this is what you're gonna use. Now we're gonna use our Go Big today. How come, Erica? Because we can. Because we can and we can cut two dies at once. These are on six by six die boards, so we can cut two at a time here. They can have a little race through the machine. <laughs> they can. Um, you can also use them in our Go Me. All right, so I'll give yep. you the shamrock. Okay. So we're gonna give a little of uh, so staticky here. In oh the yes. Studio today. And a wee bit chilly. A wee bit. A wee bit chilly. Okay. Okay, there we go. All right. Look how perfect. Here, I'll just lay this yep. on the die. Yep. So look at this. So cut out those um, peace signs perfectly. Mm -hmm. And look at the shamrock, including that little stem. Because don't you find the stem the hardest part? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. But the curves and those those little points down in there. Yeah. Now, make note, this stem curves one direction. That makes it directional. Yes. So if you want your stem to curve the other direction, you would have to cut it out with your fabric facing down. Yeah. Okay. Make a little test block. That's right. Excellent. All right, now if you are a fan of machine embroidery, AccuQuilt offers free downloadable embroidery to both of these dies with a satin stitch, a blanket stitch, and a motif stitch. And we've got some samples we here. We do, all right. All right, so shamrock, here's a blanket stitch. Here, we'll just lay them out here on our big mat. Here's a motif stitch. Somehow I misplaced my satin stitches. That's okay. Satin stitch is gonna be a really tight stitch that just goes solid all around the outside edge. It's great for wearables. So stuff right. that you're gonna, if you're doing t-shirts or sweatshirts right. or something or that's gonna get a jean jacket. Oh, perfect for that. Or something like that. Um, or if you're gonna do like a tea towel. Yeah, something's gonna get washed yeah. a lot. Yeah. 
Now, but if you want, you can do raw edge quilting, mm -hmm. you can sew a straight seam, or just inside the edge, you could do a little um, stitch there. You could use a decorative stitch, or just simply quilt over the top of all of the shapes. That's right. But we don't want you to stop with cotton because you'll want to use these shapes with all kinds of fabric. I'm thinking wool, felt, denim. You mentioned a yes. denim jacket, but what I'm if you thinking... used old jeans to Oh, that would be cute. to cut and put on like things? Like a pillow or something. Yeah. Yeah. That would be really cute. So, then think about other materials. Think about craft foam or cork yep. or cardstock. All of those great, these are great crafting shapes. Right. So many crafting possibilities. We hope you have a lot of fun with them. I think of using it um, with our pennant die. Mm -hmm. You can make peace line pennants for oh, yeah. parties, or you can do shamrocks for um, St. Patrick's Day. That's oh, yeah, cool. and you could upcycle a lot of fabrics. Or right, right. A lot of clothes. You could... Um, cover an unfortunate spot on something. Oh, there you go. And we have tons of really great ideas in our trunk show that are coming up soon. We do, we do. Quilters, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. That way you get to see our behind the scenes videos and all of our antics. It is truly antical, is that a <laughs> word? We always have so much fun and we love to share our AccuQuilt communities and stories on our social media pages. So be sure to follow us and be sure to share your finished projects, yes. right? All right, the team is shaking their heads. They say antical is not a word. However, if it was, it. it would be us. I do love it. All right, quilters, it wouldn't be one of our shows without a giveaway. That's right. Our giveaways are just one way that we can say thank you to you as being a part of our AccuQuilt family. You're all wonderful, and we are so happy to have you here with us. All right, today's lucky winner of a Go Shamrock die is, drum roll please, Pat S. of Wikia Springs, Florida. Did I say it right? Did you say it right, guys? No. No. Wikiwa. Wikiwa Springs. Wikiwa Springs. There we go. The Floridians have corrected me. All right, quilters. We are so excited today to have a special guest. AccuQuilt go-getter uh, Marjorie Busby is going to be joining us today. I have been doing her quilt along on her um, website. Oh, fabulous. For the 2022, and she's fantastic. Well, the, Marjorie has been a lifelong stitcher and quilter, and she's transitioned to quilting into a full-time job in 2009. She's one of the first to adopt the AccuQuilt system and went on to create a line of machine embroidery designs designed specifically for AccuQuilt. Marjorie's fascinated by and avidly explores digital quilting and embroidery techniques and she's a certified art and stitch instructor. You can read more from Marjorie on her Blue Feather Quilt Studio website. Yes, it's exciting. Marjorie, thank you so much for joining us Welcome. today. Welcome. Hi. We are so excited. <laughs> okay, I'm a huge fan. Um, I've followed you for years, so yes. it's so nice to finally meet you. And you've really- And I'm a fan of yours, too. Oh, well, let's see the, good, that's good. Now, Marjorie, you love mixing applique and pieced quilts, but first, we're a little curious. How long have you been appliquing, and what do you love about our AccuQuilt applique dies? Well, I made the first applique quilt in 1981. So wow. that was a long wow. time ago. Yeah. <laughs> yes when my uh, first child was born. And that quilt is still around, it's threadbare, but um, it has certainly been loved. And the second applique quilt was a jack-in-the-box and my daughter took it to college with her. She oh, wow. <laughs> loved it so much. Uh, so that, uh, what I love most about your quilt applique dies is the way they cut so perfectly right. and they cut so quickly. <laughs> um, <laughs> can you imagine cutting some of those shapes? <laughs> now, behind no. you is, at, we have like Northwoods Medley and it has the bear. I can't even ever imagine cutting the those bear shape. trees, exactly. the camper, all those shapes behind you. Yes, and that's such right. a cute quilt. Now, what are Thank some you. of the different ways that you like to applique? Well, in the beginning, when um, I first started using AccuQuilt, I didn't even have an embroidery machine. And so I learned that you can make quick and easy projects by adding the fusible web to the back, cut the applique shapes, 
and then stitch it with your regular sewing machine. You yep. can use a zigzag or a decorative machine stitch. Right. And I just did this because this is exactly how I did that. Oh, look at that with cute little sunbonnet Sue. Oh, absolutely. Exactly. And so you can use your sewing machine, regular sewing machine to stitch this down, or you can use it as a, a project to take along mm -hmm. wherever you're going when you're waiting at the dentist or whatever. <laughs> right. And, <laughs> And do hand embroidery for those people who love to do that. Right. And I think one of the most beautiful ways to use AccuQuilt dies and hand embroidery is the alphabet dies. Oh. They, they are beautiful done as uh, hand embroidery. You know, we don't often talk about doing hand we embroidery don't. on that. That's a great idea. Yeah. And I love doing hand work. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So Marjorie, yeah. how do you marry pieced blocks and applique blocks to create peace and harmony? Well, several different ways. Sometimes I will embroider into the center of a pieced block. And one example of that is the Sunbonnet Sioux bow quilt, which I changed a little bit and made it into a holiday quilt. Oh, so yes. I, instead of having Sunbonnet Sue in this, I use the Holiday Elements machine embroidery designs. I'll hold this up all the way. Oh, in my second. gosh. Yeah, yeah, that is so clever. And so that's. Oh, see, look at that. Oh, look. It has Santa and snowflakes and all the things. Yes. Yeah, so so those are perfect for Sunbonnet Sue, but they're also perfect for the holidays. Sure. Sure. And AccuQuilt has just so many wonderful patterns on the website. One pattern is called Starstruck Quilt, and it has a pieced circle in the center. And so I took a little liberty with that pattern. <laughs> I love it. And added some embroidery where that in place of that circle. So I used the grandmother's oh, flower garden look hexagon. At that. Look at that. Okay, that is so clever, Marjorie. That is. Look at how clever that is. How fun. And what a different take on it. Mm -hmm. I love so, that. So there's a lot of versatility right. with uh, that. Now, there are, sometimes I put embroidery onto pieced blocks. On top, I piece a block mm -hmm. completely and then stitch the embroidery on top of that. Right. And uh, one example, you were talking about farm animals earlier. The, there's a quilt home that I designed uh, that's called Colors and Counting Farm Animals. And that is all pieced blocks with embroidery on top. Right. And that's available, right? Yep. That's, that's on the on website. Your website. Yeah. That's yeah. on your website. Yes, that's an AccuQuilt quilt. That's and this is another example. It's very simple. It's all half square triangles. Can oh, you see this? Wow. Ooh, you didn't show this one to us yes, earlier. Yes, we have not seen this. You, one you yet. were holding out, Marjorie. Can you see the grass and the the morning sun and right. the sky? So this is my sunrise quilt. Oh, with the <laughs> and orange these, peel. And this this is the orange peel dye. Yeah. It's very simple, mm -hmm. but it has a great effect. It is, and that's such a great one for somebody who's just getting started with applique because it's such an easy curve and it's so easy to do on your domestic machine. Absolutely perfect. Yeah. 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 And then this one. Oh, wow. Okay, she, I didn't see this one either. Good job, Marjorie. Oh, wow. Look and at this That's one. from so, our stars die, right? Well, and the AccuQuilt Angles Cube. Right. Oh, look at that. So what you want to do when you're working on a block like this is simply find a place in the block. A lot of, a lot of quilt blocks have, you know, a square mm -hmm. that you can add some embroidery embellishment to. So that 
how this was done. Oh my that gosh. is gorgeous. Here we are. We we I do know, this every time. We we, we we lean way in, like okay. we can get closer to the quilt. <laughs> <laughs> so, what if you got to pick one thing that you wanted to share with everybody that you want them to know about applique? What would that be? Well, I really want them to know that applique can be used for anything. You can use it for quilts, but you can use it for table runners and mug rugs and sure. um, clothing, anything in the world. But it really is the perfect complement to personalize your quilt. Yeah. It's a beautiful way to express yourself. Oh. And whether you're making that quilt for um, fun or for congratulations or for someone you love, it is a way to truly have your heartfelt expression. Oh, oh I love that. And that's beautiful. That is beautiful. Oh, thank you so much for joining us today. We've got a couple of samples of some of your newer projects yes, here. We're, we're gonna, gonna share go. with great. everybody in just yeah. a second here. Thank you so much okay, for joining great. us today. We'll see you Thanks, again Thanks, Marjorie. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you. All right, so we want to show you a couple of Marjorie's new projects. And the first one we're going to show you is her ginger cookie quilt pattern. And this is a quilt pattern and embroidery by Marjorie. It's available as a combination purchase on our website. And it's downloadable. And this is so adorable. So what you'll see here is the small houses die and the gingerbread cookie die with the cookie decorations pieced blocks that alternate with it, and then this is the square in a square, or square on point. Square on point, yeah. But I have to tell you, this embroidery is so detailed, it's so cute. I mean, it's got the little snowflakes on the snow house. on it's the gingerbread got, houses. It's got little candy canes, the Christmas tree, a little snowflake on our little cookie girl's dress. Right. I mean, the little greenery in the window, it is so, so adorable, it is so detailed, it's absolutely gorgeous. And again, this is a new project, Marjorie is doing these now where she combines the pattern and the special applique, right. the special machine embroidery to go with it. So here is another one of her new projects. This is her brand new Go Sea Life Medley die quilt pattern with embroidery. So this one's using our Sea Life Medley die, and look at this, this is so cute. Again, this is available to order um, on our website with the two, with the combo. Look at the little eyeballs. Look at how fun they are. Crab, the starfish that are embroidered here, the little waves. It's just so fun. This would be, wouldn't this be the most perfect baby quilt it in the world? It would be. And then look, she's used these great batiks on the back as it's well. So, and her quilting is amazing. Good job, Marjorie. Amazing, they're so wonderful. I love how she's doing this now, and she's doing right. the pattern with the special embroidery design right. that comes with it. So right. be sure to check well, that out. Because then everything you need, right, yes. all together. Yes, and those are paid downloads. They're on AccuQuilt's website, and it's so worth it. And then, you know, you could, I mean, I just want to put those little gingerbread houses everywhere for Christmas. Right, yeah. Everywhere. I would love, like, a table runner. Oh, it'd be perfect would for that. Would be fun? Yes. See, look at this. This is what happens this when we come here on Tuesday. Every time we come up with ideas. All right, quilters, now that you've seen our two new dies in action on our two Tuesdays, we want to know which die is your favorite. That's right. Is it the Go Peace sign? Is it the Go Shamrock die? Or is it both? Now, if you're watching by the registration link or on YouTube, you can click the vote box below or to the right of the chat box. That's right. And if you're watching on Facebook, vote from the box that displays over our video. All right, now in case you're just now joining us for the show, we have bundles available that are already marked down. So be sure to add the Go Shamrock die and the Go Peace Sign die to your collection. And don't forget today's promo code, SPRING35, S-P-R-I-N-G-3-5. This code will save you 35% on dies and bundles. Some exclusions apply for the deal, so check the website for details. And you'll get free shipping if your order reaches $150 or more if you live in the contiguous U.S. No codes needed to redeem that offer at checkout. 
And quilters, if you're uh, looking for inspiration like Eric and I are, be sure to join me every Wednesday at 12 noon Central Time for AccuQuilt Live. Tomorrow, we're going to be making the Go Shamrock project that's behind us today. Be sure and register for the show on our events page to be entered for the chance to win an exciting door prize. It's going to be tons of fun, and I hope to see you there. I might wear my tie-dye yeah, Very, very bright and colorful. Yeah. So <laughs> Nobody will miss you if you, you yeah. wear that. If you go out in a crowd, I know. Gonna, your family will find you. Now, because February is National Embroidery Month, we want to highlight some of the great embroidery designs that we have available that go along with our dyes. And don't forget, we always have that basic embroidery available as a free download for all of our non-designer shapes. But we also have some amazing paid downloads that are currently 15% off because it is National Embroidery That's Month. right. That's going to include some um, by our good friend Marjorie, who you just met earlier on the show. That's right. So let's take a look at some of the shapes that we that are going to work alongside our fun new dies. The first one we want to talk about is our cute car. And Marjorie has a great set of paid embroideries that go with this that turn it into several different vehicles, including a really fun little love bug. Super cute. Super cute. And then look, here's some other ones. So here is our, he is our beach buggy. Our beach buggy. This that. one's by V-Stitch Design. Yeah, these are our good friends at V-Stitch. And then this one is perfect for school because it has like the teacher. And it's got the apple on top. Yep. It's very fun. Very fun. All right. And we have so many ways to use this one um, when we embroider. They're designs, like we said, from Marjorie mm -hmm. and from V-Stitch. And we have various holiday ones yes. as well. So do you and have what this? is coming up? St. No, Patrick's you have Day. It. Oh, I have all of them. You have everything. It's in this pile, I think. Is it? Oh, oh it is. OK. Look at this one. Look at her. Look at this. This is St. Patrick's Day card design, again, from our good friends at V-Stitch. And the detail that the digitizers put in, that V-Stitch and Marjorie put into their designs, I mean, the license plate says lucky. Yeah. Yeah. And the um, radio antenna has a, a shamrock. shamrock. So cute. Now, a natural shape to go along with our shamrock is the horseshoe shape from the Go Western Medley. Now, we've got fun options for this die as well. And there's also embroidery design by V-Stitch that will turn our little horse into a magical unicorn. Look at this. And Pam is showing it off because she has made a few of these. Oh, a bazillion. We did a whole <laughs> quilt for Oakley. Um, and I used the tumbler dies, so it was mm -hmm. perfect, okay? Mm -hmm. And don't forget, when you're using the um, Western Medley, the horseshoe needs to sit up for the luck oh, doesn't so run out. so the luck out. doesn't run out. That's yeah. right. All right, next we have our little heart die. Oh, yes, I and love this. This is really fun. Um, it has the three sizes of hearts, two, three, and four inches, and everybody needs one of these. Everyone. And not just for Valentine's Day, but you're going to see this shape in one of our trunk show projects that's coming up. So yep. just wait and yep. see. So again, all of these have free embroidery downloads, but we also have for purchase. Oh, absolutely. Ones that are just turn them yep. into wonderful things. So many crafting possibilities with that heart die. I love it. All the days. All right, our good friends at Timeless Treasures have are helping us make this a lucky launch party. And we have two, because it's two, 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 two Tuesdays. Two, 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 two Tuesday. Um, selections of fabric to give away. Okay, so let's look at this one, because I feel like this is so bright. This would be really fun to do with like yes. the peace sign, because it just yes. has all of these bright, yummy colors. And this one is all blues, and I love it. It's so fun. Blues there. But Erica's metallic. Yeah. You know, we're seeing so much of the gold metallic in fabrics. This is just so on trend. You could have so much fun with this. All right, quilters, the first winner of a Timeless Treasures fabric selection is, drum roll, please. Joyce J of Oakdale, Louisiana. Congratulations. Congratulations. All right. The winner of a second selection of fabric is, drum roll please. Bonnie S. from Canby, Oregon. Congratulations. And a huge shout out to Timeless Treasures for sponsoring today's show. We know our quilters are gonna make some lucky, oh, projects using this fabric. That's right. 
All right, quilters, if you want more inspiration like what you see on our show or what Pam and I come up with while we're talking, our quilting heads. there are at least two new blog posts posted each and every week with innovative ways to use the dyes that you already own and quite possibly inspire you to get some others. Discover everything we've mentioned and more when you subscribe to the AccuQuilt blog. And what's on the blog? Today, you're gonna see a little bit of a close-up look at all of the great samples that we have that came oh, out fun. today with the peace sign and the shamrock die that are free downloads at AccuQuilt.com. Now, quilters, don't forget, we have bundles that are already available and marked down. Be sure to add the Go Shamrock and Peace Sign die to your AccuQuilt collection. And don't forget that we have a promotion code today too, SPRING35. This code will save you 35% on dies and bundles. Some exclusions apply for the deal, so check out the website for details. Yeah. Plus, quilters, you're going to remember you're going to receive free shipping when your order reaches $150 or more and you live in the contiguous U.S. No code is needed to redeem the free shipping offer. That's right. All right, quilters, at the start of this year, we introduced our Paying It Forward campaign called Covering the World One Quilt at a Time. This campaign is a collaboration between AccuQuilt and Moda Fabrics with Baby Lock as our sponsor. Now today, one person from, together, one person from our teams is donating a quilt each week of 2022 to a charity of their choice. Now last week's donation was made by Moda team members Kathy Skomp and Becca Pipes from Lavender Lime Designs. They designed their quilts with, oh, I can hardly Look say the words, grunge love, number eight, patchwork quilt pattern, and they used our Go Heart die. Kathy and Becca donated their quilt to COVID ICU nurses and a couple, Joel and Presley Lucas, to give them comfort in their efforts of fighting the spread of COVID-19. This is such a great and meaningful um, donation. I love it. Be sure to visit our website for details on how you can join us and participate in covering the world one quilt at a time by going to learn.accuquilt.com slash quilt the world 2022. You can also follow the hashtag hashtag quilt the world 2022 on our social media to see fellow quilters donations throughout the year. And there's and some wonderful some amazing quilts. amazing ones. Be sure to check it out. Quilters, earlier in the show, we asked you which new dye is your favorite? Is it the Go Peace Sign, the Go Shamrock, or is it both of them? If you're watching by the registration link on YouTube, uh, or on YouTube, uh, you can click the vote box below or to the right of the chat box. That's right. And if you're watching via Facebook, vote from the box that displays over the video. Now, while everybody gets their votes on, um, let's take a look at today's trunk show because this is super fun. This is, we know why you really came. Okay, yeah. we're gonna start off with a pillow and this is such a cute project. This is our Go Rainbow Peace Pillow. Um, Christina Brinkerhoff of Center Street Quilts and she used Riley Blake fabric. Okay, and this is the pattern that's on um, the packaging. Yes. And Every time we release a die, Eric and I do a whole video dedicated yes. to that die. So if you want to know how to make this project, just check out that. It's on our website. Isn't this so cute? I do love a good pillow. It really is. Okay. So next up, we've got the Go Give Peace Cross Body Bag. Now, this was designed. Look, isn't this cute? This is so By cute. Marianne Fontana with Fontana Originals. Look and at the little pocket It has Marianne pockets on both on sides. Okay, I'm totally going to make one of these for Oakley. Yes. This is perfect for her. It is. It doesn't go across her body, and it's just really cute. And I just love it. I yeah. love the fabrics. And it's, it's kind so of fun. that denim fabric. Mm -hmm. It is. Good job, Marianne. All right, next up, oh, and we love these. These are definitely on the to-do oh, list. I'm gonna give you gosh. one to hold up, and I'm gonna okay, hold up Okay, Missy Scheffler of Scheffler Studios and Timeless Treasure made these peace sign snack mats. Okay, I am a huge modern quilter. I love everything about these. <laughs> I love the whole black and white, and I love that there's just a touch of color. The pop and look, of color. Here's yep. the orange one. So I think at the Heller House for spring, I think these, are, I'm gonna make a whole bunch of these for our house. Well, and she's quilted them different ways. This one's got like crosswise. This is just straight lines one way. And that one's straight lines. And I don't know about you, but I notice that small children don't tend to keep their snacks in just one place. So no. this is a great way to try and uh, keep those crumbs to a minimum. Yeah, no, mm -hmm. these are great. Good job, Missy. We love it. Okay, this next one is so sweet and you would never 
You, you see so many designs in here. This is the Go Pretty Mini Quilt. This is by Missy Shepler of Shepler Studios with Timeless Treasures Fabric. And look at all the different designs and the secondary designs that you see just by putting those peace signs together. Okay, I never in my whole quilting head would have thought about look this. At, Good job, you Missy. You see the squares and the diamonds. Right? It's just really fun. It's just beautiful. And I love the fact that she used these bright batiks. Mm -hmm. And then look at how pretty the back is. Isn't it pretty? Pretty floral. And again, just a straight diagonal stitch. I think when it. we get to these where they're so intricate, you know, the design is like that, that straight stitch looks really well. It really does. Okay, next up. Oh, this is so fun. Our good Steph, friend Steph Jacobson, who lives here in Omaha. She did design this. She made this. this. I got to find it, make sure it goes the we're right gonna, way. We're going to take some quite the, oh, we're upside down. There we go. And this is a big one. This is this is, is a bigger than Erica kind of quilt. Yeah, I'm going to hold up most. Okay. Of it. So here we can see we've got our peace sign, right? Yes. We've got our heart. This is the big one from the four heart. We've got our cute car, and then this is funky flowers. Isn't that? Isn't so cute? this fun? All batiks. Let's peek your head down here. But isn't that go. fun? Look at this, and then. Um, Stephanie um, used four different colors of thread. So there's a green up here and then it goes into pink and, and yellow. Yeah, it's really fun. Good job, Stephanie. And again, a very modern feel, but yet that real vintage kind of vibe. We yeah. were vintage thrifting this weekend. Okay, this is on the back. Oh, okay. I will talk about it. Well, you will read and I will talk. Oh, okay. So this is the Go Treasures of Gold wall hanging. This is by Amanda Harward of Larkspur Quilts. And she has used Timeless Treasures fabric. And this again is the one that Pam's gonna make tomorrow. And this is great. It's two basic blocks, but it's the applique that just makes it sing. So this is the um, two inch finished square. So it finishes to six inches. And then this is the 12 inch cube, right? So. This is that triangle in a square shape. Mm -hmm. And yeah, we've used the um, Western Medley Horseshoe and then our new Shamrock. So this is gonna be so fast. You're gonna be able to do this like this weekend. It's really a fun project. I will be watching tomorrow it as you make great. that. All right, here we have the, oh, it's hanging up. The wreath. Oh gosh, they hung it. So go, here. I wish you luck wreath from Marianne Fontana of Fontana Originals. This is so fun. It's such a great no-sew project. Right. She used felt and craft foam, right? Right, and the styrofoam, um, the wreath is styrofoam that she covered mm -hmm. and then just hot glued for days with a ribbon on it. Right. I love it. I think this is great. It is so, so in cute. In my quilting head, so like you could totally do it with a peace sign and do, oh, yeah. You know, you all of do it with the hearts. Spring and the hearts. Think about doing it for sports seasons. Oh, yes. There's yeah. the dye for There's that. There's the dye for that. <laughs> okay. All right. Now we can show these placemats because I love them. These are the Lucky Charms placemats by Marianne. Marianne was feeling the luck of the Irish, she wasn't was she? She was feeling very. Yes, she was feeling magically delicious, <laughs> right? <laughs> but this is such an easy block. It is all done with half square and quarter square triangles. And what makes it, it makes that intricate looking design, but it's super simple, super fast, and then the shamrocks in the corners. It's just, just a cube. Just a cube, two yep. colors. It's so simple. Really fun. But it just has such an impact. All right, next up, we've got the gold shamrock. Oh, this is the Go Luck of the Irish yeah. chain throw quilt. Yep. And this is fun because this is a take on the classic Irish chain quilt pattern, right? It is. You're going to see those, those diagonal lines of the squares making that Irish chain. And then we've got our square that has our shamrock. And I do the love middle. the fact that um, Marianne made it very scrappy looking, right? Mm -hmm. You could just mm -hmm. totally use your scraps for it. And then look at how fun this back is. We don't often show green on our... We don't because sometimes show. it doesn't show up because we have so much green. But we are definitely not wearing... Well, I have green in everything else. This is all go green here. This is all go green. All right. And should we end with a pillow? We're going to end this with another pillow. This is the Go Shamrock Swirl Pillow. This one's by Melanie Call of A Bit of Scrap Stuff. She used Riley Blake fabrics and she used our cube and companions for this. And she used our 10 inch cube we measured. Yes, we did. Right, so here's our companion angles and corners. You need that kite shape 
and then that signature block. Mm -hmm. So as we were shown this this morning, you totally could change the colorway and use the peace sign. You could totally use the change of the colorway and do spring. I yes. just think this is darling. It's and this is really one of those is. little pillows that you could just make as a cover. Yeah, right? we should it's show the, the back because she okay. she's look at this. She's got a zipper in the back. So okay. how fun is this? What a fast way to change up your decor. Yeah. But a little zipper. just have your pillow form and I have a new couch, I have all kinds of pillows, and they all need new pillow covers, so. Melanie Call can help you out. Thank you, Melanie. Okay, we want to take a minute. These patterns are all available as free downloads on AccuQuilt's website, so you can be sure to download these patterns before your dye arrives, so you'll be all ready to go. But you know what? what? We've got some more embroidery over there to show. Oh, shall we show some more? Let's show some more embroidery. Okay. So these are some designs by V-Stitch, that go with some of the dyes that we've talked about. And we're gonna talk about the peace sign and the Western medley and the shamrock. Right. Okay, so here's the boot. Should we start with here? With yeah, the let's boot? start with the boot. So the boot, here's our fun little stitches for the boot. I love the She's fact. She's done some the, really fun things with right? these. Right, and there's a little star in your boot. star. There's a snake in my boot. I hope one has a snake. I, I don't, don't think, think it, does. it does. But that's great. There's a purple pony. There is purple ponies. And look, there's gray ones. I love the fact that they have eyes and ears and yes. a face. Oh. This one is super cute because it has super that mane. Super cute. But I love the fact that these are such great scrap busters, right? Oh, you absolutely. Can just totally use what you have. Wait till you see the, the horseshoes, too. Yes. So, so, again, that's a blanket stitch. Now, here it gets a little bit more complex. She's got a little star and, and some markings on it. Right. A little bit bigger star. Wait for this, and it says good luck and has a shamrock on it. Look, how so cute. perfect for our project that we're making tomorrow. Absolutely. I love this. All right, do you want to talk about your peace sign? Yeah, so I want to talk about the peace sign. Here is the purple peace sign. And again, we've got a blanket stitch. This is just a really nice little blanket stitch. But V Stitch has also done some other fun things. And remember, these, uh, the paid applique designs, embroidery designs are all gonna be 15% off for National right. Embroidery Month. Here's a, this fun flat design. Look how fun this motif okay, is this with this. Is so cute. But if you're starting to think ahead to the holidays, look, peace on earth. Oh, look, with jingle bells. With jingle bells and holly leaves. Here we've got peace and love. You know what she should have done? She should have done quilting underneath. So it was oh, peace, love, and quilting. Yeah, all the things we need, the trifecta. And then here's another motif stitch. Really fun designs for the peace sign. Okay, and then we're going to just think outside the box for a minute because okay. you know how we love a good We grab these and, and they're not, uh, we apologize, they are not. To our whole team who's going, why are they showing gnomes? Okay, first of all, we're showing gnomes because they are just super cute. They are and they have shamrocks. And they have shamrocks and just so much fun. So our gnome mess mm -hmm. and our gnome. So if you own the gnome dies, and you're Shamrock, looking. gnome, one, gnome man, and gnome girl. Yeah, yeah, if you're looking for those. Okay, a great day, because they're all 15. Wait, bring the shamrocks over. Oh, here. We forgot the shamrocks. Good thing you're here. It wouldn't be lucky to forget your shamrocks. I know. Look all at right. this. There we go. There's our blanket stitch again. We've got... There's here. your satin stitch. There's our satin about. stitch. Here is the motif stitch. Mm -hmm. Cute with the fabric with the pattern in it. Now here she's got some real d detail in here. So the little hearts inside and a little highlight. Here this one's got a little swirl and this one's got swirls all over. All for the shamrocks. Just so detailed. You could do a quilt and have them all different. Have yes. different embroidery and all the different ones. Huge okay. shout out to all of our designers. So Marjorie and our good friends at V-Stitch who do so many great so things. So many things so creative. All right, quilters voting has now closed. So while the team is gonna tally your votes to see which die is your new favorite, we are gonna give away our final prize of the day. Let's do, let's say thanks again to our quilters for watching our show today. All right, let's do it. The lucky winner of a Go Peace Sign die is, drum roll please. Karen H. from Chubbuck, Idaho, congratulations. <laughs> Idaho for a hot no, we haven't. So have you all had fun with that lucky vintage oh vibe today? Gosh, we're loving it. 
All right. Well, quilters, the time has come. The team has counted all of your votes, and it's time to announce the results. That's right. You voted and decided that your favorite die of the two dies is, drum roll, please. Both. Yay! Yay. It's too hard to pick, isn't it? It is. It, it really is. These are great dies. I think they're going to add so much to quilters projects. Right. There's so many, not just quilt possibilities, right. but craft possibilities. Right. And I think that that's one of the things I love about it is that, mm -hmm. you know, you can embellish things, you can add them both to, you know, packagings and you can do bags and gifts and yep. all of those kind of things. So yeah, a great way to craft. Is there a way to make, you know, have you seen people with like the headbands and the shamrocks? And I wonder, those are kind of big for oh, that, but we, should probably we could probably that. work on that. Do we have a show on the 17th? Of March? No, oh. I don't think so. Okay. That's right. All but right. we do have a show this week. Guess yeah, <gasps> what? You get to see us this week on Thursday, February That's 24th right. at 12 noon Central Time for the first part of our limited series called On the Go. Okay, QuiltCon in Phoenix, Arizona. Be still my heart. So QuiltCon just happened this past yes, weekend. Yes, it did. And we have a team there. We're going to talk to several go-getters. We're going to see all the amazing quilts. So um, if you're not familiar with modern quilting, you want to check out the show because there Absolutely. are some this is, phenomenal, phenomenal This is quilts. going to be a great way to see what was at the show without having been at the show if you're like us and didn't get to go. Yes. So make sure you register for this show. It's on our website on the events page for your chance to win door prizes because that, my friends, is how you win, by registering. That's right. All right, quilters, remember we have Go Shamrock die and Go Peace Sign dies available today, and they're already marked down. To get your order in during the show, you can use your phone's camera to capture the QR image and go right to the site. Now, the first bundle we have is the Go Tuesday die bundle. It comes with the Go Peace Sign, the Go Shamrock die, a six by six cutting mat, and the embroidery designs for both the Peace Sign and the Shamrock. This bundle is valued at $109, but you can get it today for $74.99, saving you over $33. Now, the second bundle we have for you is the Go Groovy die bundle. Groovy. You get the Go Peace Sign with the Go Cute Car, the Go Square 6-inch finished for appliqueing them on, and three mats, 6x6, six 5x10, by six, by and 10x10. Ten ten. The bundle is valued at $167, but you're going to be able to add it to your collection today for just $119.99, saving you over $46. Next, we have the Go Love and Luck die bundle. Get the Go Shamrock, the Go Hearts, which have the three sizes of hearts, that Western medley die and three cutting mats. This bundle is valued at $187, but you can get it today for $119.99, saving you over $66. And if you're luck feeling lucky, this is the best. The this last is, is not the least. We have the Go Peace, Love, and Luck die bundle. Here you're going to get the Go Peace sign and Go Shamrock along with the Go Hearts, the Go Western Medley, the Go Cute Car, and the Go 6-inch Finish Square, and four different sizes of cutting mats. Now, this bundle is valued at $332, but you can get it today for just $219.99. It's going to save you over $111, the best value of the day. Yeah, that's the one you want. But wait, there's more. You can use that promo code SPRING35 to get 35% off dies and bundles at checkout. Some exclusions apply, so check the website for details. Quilters, don't forget those bundles we just mentioned are already marked down and won't be eligible for the promo code. But there are so many items you can stock up with on Spring 35. That's right. And you'll get free shipping when your order reaches $150 or more if you live in the contiguous U.S. Now, no code is needed at checkout to redeem that offer. But we do have one more promo for the day. It's called Cut 150, C-U-T 150. You're gonna take $150 off the Go Fabric Cutter or the Ready, Set, Go Ultimate Fabric Cutting System. Now remember, quilters, you can only use one code at a time. That's right. This offer is perfect if you are looking to upgrade from the Go Me Fabric Cutter or if you're just getting started with AccuQuilt and looking to start your journey. 
Absolutely. Now, quilters, if you don't have access to a QR reader, no worries. Just open up a new tab in your browser. Go to the top of the page, click on that plus sign. In that very top box, type in accuquilt.com slash party to see the bundles and place your order. You can also find our products at the end of the rainbow at your local AccuQuilt retailer. To find the retailer closest to you, check out the store locator. It's at the top of the page at accuquilt.com. Remember, you can quilt now, pay later. Get your financing today at accuquilt.com slash financing. All right. I believe it's time for us to go sew something peaceful and lucky. Yes. <laughs> we hope that you're as excited as we are about the creative possibilities with our new Go Peace Sign die and the new Go Shamrock die. Quilters, thanks so much for joining us today. If you've been waiting for our show to end before you buy, now is that time. Sure Here's it is. The link, get everything you need while it's still available. And remember, at AccuQuilt, we help you cut time. So you can quilt more. We'll see you Thursday. Goodbye.